Right, good evening, welcome back to another vlog. Yes, tonight we have come, well I say we, because I'm joined by Chris and Hayley from Adventure Times UK. I'll get, she's over there, I'll get you in in a sec, I'll walk over. So I've spotted someone else is here as well. I'll get them on the telly and all. But yeah, we're here at Fe uh, Fear, Avon Valley. Here's a sign for it. Never been here before. This is one, hey, he's taking pictures of me. This is one of the ones that um, looks amazing and I just don't seem to have, have come here and I've been invited, thanks a lot, by Chris Hello. and Hayley because they had a spare ticket going. Adventure Times UK on YouTube. I've already so. mentioned it, yes. <laughs> Down there somewhere, go, it will be in the link in the description. But yeah, so thank you very much. Here's Hayley. Thank you for inviting me along. It's all right. Came and picked me up as well. Yeah. Just yeah. Been, to, been to Waitrose and got some Snacks and Snacks. a drink. Oh. Yeah, look who else is. You're all. I can't get away from you. Well, we were just thinking the same. Yeah, yeah, it's because you're after more money off me, that's why. Well, you've <laughs> still not paid your invoice. Oh, yeah? if, if, oh. if it carries on like this, you'll invoice? be getting Invoice? What invoice? Invoice, yeah, it's not just a deposit payment, mate. Oh, is it not? Oh, right, yeah. Carry, <laughs> carry on, we'll remove you. Oh, we'll get banned. No, yeah. my first time here, so what... what... Alright, turn the camera around if you're vlogging yourself. <laughs> Alright, you yeah, yeah. But <laughs> what, what am I expecting Why? from here? Uh, mazes. So mazes. It's Halloween mazes. So it's a scare event. I've never been. Have you not? Me no. Neither. I'm with you, Andy. Yeah, I've never been. You've got, you've got scare mazes. Yeah. That's good. Some roaming actors. Yeah. yeah. Food. Food. Drink. Rides. <laughs> there's a... A show as well. There's a show, show. as well. Yeah. There's toilets. Wow, awesome. Yeah. So, it sound, so it basically sounds exactly the same as all the other scare events. You know what? Yes. But this is supposed to be one of the best though, isn't it? You, you guys rave about we it. We loved it last year, yeah. 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 So, uh, I'm, not, I'm not giving you any spoilers. Oh, I don't want any spoilers. Anyway, Craig Toy is here as well. His oh, first yeah. time as well. The man, oh, the myth, yeah. the legend, oh, right. apparently. <laughs> Running away from us here, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, we'll get in, show you what's here. We Wait, can't... One with well, these three, these two here. These three, yeah, what, three, two, two. two. Well, there, Andy. But, but yeah, we've got um, like VIP passes and well, but we can't we can't film in mazes apparently here. No, 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 no. So we'll do the mazes, give you a review. Anyway, see anything? No, what with my uh, special camera? It's good. It's good. Got some good footage. So uh, yeah, we'll see you in a bit. Right, so we're in, and thanks to Chris and Haley for obviously inviting me along. I didn't personally get invited like some other channels did, but I'll show you what we've got in a bit. And then straight away, we've got like this clown thing. Yeah, we can't film in the mazes tonight, but we do have unlimited fast tracks. Um, what did it? What else have we got, Chris? We've got a whole pocket full of random stuff. We've got all sorts of stuff. Yeah, there's. Um, doing the light Andy. Yeah, there's actually. It is actually a. <laughs> preview night tonight and there's more previewers than there is normal guests oh my god what's in here i can't see anything oh it's a trouble oh this is cool oh my god oh well that's unique straight away <laughs> straight away into like some sort of well, it's a vortex tunnel before you've even got into the uh, event. That's really cool. Yeah, so we've got, um, I, I don't know, I'll try and show you in a minute, but there's like ride passes, drinks vouchers, all sorts of stuff. Uh, first time I've ever been here. A lot of goodies. Uh, so we have got a photo cards, we've got a drinks token, behind that we have a golden ticket. I don't know what that's for. Um, we've got a cup token, one meal token, an electric chair token, oh my God. one thrill ride, two thrill rides, Whoa. and unlimited fast track, unlimited maze access. It's mad, isn't it? We've actually got more stuff here than we would have got at like Tully's or the Howl or Scarefest or anywhere, basically. Crazy. The other and thing I want, nice yeah, the land. lanyard as well. The other thing is I want to point out, it was actually the first night of Journey to Hell Freak Nights at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Yeah, we don't know anyone that even went there because everyone went to Scarefest last year. Well, last night, should I say. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I'll have to get these guys to show me around because I don't know where anything is. I'm guessing there's a there's a maze there. There's one over there. 
Well, what time? What time is it on till? About eleven ish. Eleven ish. Ish. Uh, I don't know. We don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We're just here to a bloody good time. Bloody good bloody time. Good time. Uh, is that your motto? No, that's their motto. That's their <laughs> his motto. Oh, their motto. Just then. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't feel that. Yeah. Have a bloody good time. So you got the bar and stuff over here as well, and yeah. The guys from your experience guide are here, Scott, we've already seen. Tom and Stacey here as well. Yeah, all right. Fancy camera. Smart, isn't it? Yeah. Don't, don't need uh, no big lighting rig with this, do I? No. I mean, you can't see uh. anything in the daylight, so what's <laughs> Where's your new fancy camera? Yeah. I mean, I mean hey, is, that, a bit, is that a camera in your pocket you're that's excited to see me? Is it? It's been it? years, yeah. yeah. And, the gorgeous oh, yeah, Stacy. Hello. Ah, oh, so you've not seen you for ages. I think how it was. Where was it? Goose Fair. Yeah, that was that was the last time. Uh, how was Dubai? Oh, amazing. Yeah, we loved it. Even though you was messaging me asking if IMG was an indoor theme park, can't believe yeah. you didn't know. No, I didn't know anything. <laughs> no research. No research. Do your research. Best way to do it. No, no best way. Do you... Don't do your research, and then you'll be more surprised. We like a surprise. Yeah, do your research so you know what. No, the... I know nothing about tonight. I'd... No, not a clue. Uh, Nothing. <laughs> Apparently, there's um, one the way you you got to wear waders or something. Clown, clown mazes, yeah. right? So uh, yeah, let's uh, let, let's get going. I suppose. We'll go with these guys over here as well. <laughs> Bit of it. Yeah. So there's fun fair rides. There's food stalls. There's the beer tent. There's a waltzer. Probably done that one. Ooh. Good, isn't it? Yeah, he's very good. Yeah. Yeah, I got a crash car. I would have had that. That's what happens when I drive. It was it. Oh god, well you're not driving back home then. Oh we've got Oh yeah, look at this. Uh -huh. I'm yellowing, baby! <laughs> Do you buy your phone? Oh that's scary. <laughs> oh it's scary. That is scary. Run away! <laughs> oh god. Yeah, they got a merch shop over here. Ooh. Oh, I like the caps. Caps are nice. Snapback caps, yeah, they're cool, those. It's all embroidered as well. Really smart. You seen the caps? Caps are cool. Some really nice t shirts. What? Oh, the beanie, yeah, that's smart, that. Yeah, is that embroidered? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's cool, is that? Happy Halloween, baby! <laughs> yeah, so far it's pretty good here. Let's go and check out the drinks bar. Yeah, Roman axes. What? <laughs> yeah, let's have a look what they've got for drinks. Beers and ciders. Uh, not Greg toys here. Yeah, not really much I like to be honest. Oh, they got groovy cups though. That's cool. We like the uh, plastic cups. Right, what you got there, Haley? The meaty mac beef with no jalapenos. Oh, looks good that. And you've got the same I've thing. I've got the same thing, just without all the uh, healthy stuff. Oh, looks good. The I'm not having anything because I had some food before we sort of left. Before the I had scampi and chips at a pub. Yeah, I love it. I love my scampi and chips. But yeah, I'll just show you over here what they do do. We do have some food tokens. And um, yeah, they've got this American Pit smoked barbecue over here, and the staff are dressed up like your costumes. <laughs> Thank you very much. But yeah, pulled pork sandwich. Do love a pulled pork sandwich. Dirty beef brisket sandwich, mac and cheese, burnt ends with beans. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> I do like my barbecue stuff. I really do. And there's some other things as well, mucky beans, house fries, topped with our burnt end beans. Oh god, yeah. I do like some American stuff. Yeah, I might go on the waltzer in a minute because the mazes don't open till seven o'clock. So we're letting at six. Mazes don't open till seven. And it's currently well it's not even quarter to seven yet. So uh, yeah. <laughs> oh here he is again. Ooh, run away! Oh! Oh, he's just brought that window! 
Oh, good job the uh, shard of glass didn't go flying into the air that he just whacked. Awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, it's good to see people that are here. I've seen quite a few enthusiasts. How's your food? Very nice. Very nice, apparently. Yeah, I'll probably go and do the waltz in a minute, but yeah, we'll have a walk around, show you what's here. We can't film in the mazes, which is a bit of a shame, but I sort of get that because they don't want anything being spoiled. And it gives you the option to come if you like what you see that we've filmed. So, uh, yeah, happy days. show every hour on the hour and there's a laser show down there as well apparently yeah this is pretty oh here they go whoa the fire same thing about the food I had at the Howl. I had barbecue um, on the, the chicken strips at the Howl. Obviously you guys haven't been yet, you're going yeah. on Tuesday. Tomorrow. But yeah, the, the barbecue sauce was that much. It yeah. sort of overpowered the flavour of everything else. The beef was really nice though. Yeah, how was yours? I'm gorgeous. Yeah, I loved it. Loved it. Yeah, Walls are going around now as well. Yeah, that show, it's on every hour and it was amazing. It's all right, it's all right. Yeah, it was good that, you got the fire around. Yeah, they've actually got this street down here, I'll show you in a second. Apparently it's not actually finished, you got Dills there. All right, Dills. Yeah, there's a street here and they're actually supposed to have, well, a tattooist in there, but apparently um, it, it, it's not actually finished or they, they didn't set it up properly. But yeah, I can't wait for this event. There's another show, an upcharge show. There's the rides, there's the mazes, yeah, hopefully I'll have a good night here at Fear at Avon Valley. Right, so our first maze of the night is called Malefica. I will probably forget what it's called, so I'll have to ask these guys to remind me. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not good at remembering stuff, and yeah, we do have the fast passes. It's busy here tonight, first opening night. And they do a child-friendly version as well. But just watch where you walk and it is quite muddy around and there's like rocks and stuff. I nearly I nearly twisted my ankle earlier on a on a rock on the floor. Yeah, it's busy in here. But yeah, I always feel uh, a bit privileged when you're when you're in a, a VIP queue. Yeah. Don't don't tell everyone. <laughs> I have no idea what's in here, but yeah, we can't film in here, so I'll give you a review when we come out the end. Oh my god, what the hell was even that? I mean, Jesus, I mean, I know I've already done the tull, Tullies, the Howl, many other scare events before, but I don't think I've ever jumped so much in a scare maze in all my life in there. It was basically, what would you say, it was like a church? Yeah, with like nuns and things. <laughs> And because I've never done a scare event with these two before, I was jumping more because of her. Scream I was screaming and then she was screaming. I'm like, what? <coughs> Someone made him jump and he kept doing that. <laughs> How good?
good was that? That was incredible. That was a much better than last <laughs> Oh time. really? I, yeah. My first time, so I had no idea oh, what was in there. That's a good start. Really that good theming in there. Yeah. One of really good, look at her. <laughs> that's what I was like in there. Because I was screaming, she was screaming, and vice versa. We need to do more scare events together, <laughs> Hayley. I think, yeah, it'd be more fun, I think. Oh, that was well, I think we should make Chris go first in the next I one. I don't know, I don't know. I do like going first, so I mean, yeah, I do like oh, the well, jump you scares. Can go first. Yeah, so they're basically in these tents, a bit like Dr. Fright's, there's another tent over here as well. But that was awesome, was that, wasn't it? <laughs> Loads of jump scares oh, in there. The theming was brilliant, the lighting was good, lots of um, head ticklers, yeah. like. Yeah, what a great start, as Chris just said then, that was brilliant. You just dropped them on the floor, by the way. Yeah, that was awesome. Really good start. And it was called Ma Ma Malefica. 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 There you go. I'll probably not have to say it again tonight. Right, let's fucking... Christ almighty. I, I, yeah, again, I wish I could film in some of these mazes for like first reactions. But that was awesome. Really, really good start to the night. Really enjoyed that maze. Right, so this is the next one, House of Clowns. Yeah, look at the line here for the regular queue. So yeah, fast track and that. This event's really good so far. And we've only done one maze. Like the central hub here is brilliant with the stage and the show and the rides. It's not raining now, I was chucking it down a second ago. But yeah, good old clown maze. Apparently this one's a really good one. So uh, yeah, I can could, I could film this bit. Thank you. It is rammed here tonight. You can see it's a popular event. Look how busy it is. Bloody hell. Christ almighty. There's probably the same amount of people in here in this one tent than there was at the whole entire event at the Howl, really. Look at it, it's rammed in here. Again, watch where you're walking because I nearly slipped on the mud down there. Vlog on vlog. Vlog on vlog. Old school. <laughs> Yeah, good old clown maze. God, I'm still, my heart is still beating from that last maze. I'm barely getting my breath back. We need, we, we, we definitely <laughs> need to do more scare events together. That was awesome. I can't wait for the rest of the night. Right, so we've just come out of House of Clowns here. Yeah, typical clown maze. There's not much in there that I've not seen before. However, I think there was pressure points on the floor because it was like shots of air, were they? they? They were pretty cool. And there's a bit of a mirror maze in there as well. Um, a late, sort of a laser room as well before you go in, like you see here at Tully's with a green laser. Just one room and the girl sort of pops up out of the laser. Yeah, it's not bad, not bad. As car mazes go, it's not bad. Car mazes for me, you either take them or leave them. But it was actually pretty good. We got some good scares in there. Yeah, I love a good car maze. <laughs> But they've, they've stepped up again since last year. There's oh, really? more actors in there, yeah. Wow. My heart is pounding. Yeah, I know. Same. <laughs> I'm not going to have much of a voice left by the end of the night, that's for sure. No. It's, it's the way that he lets go of my hand and you just feel him going like this behind me. <laughs> oh, awesome. I love it. Yeah. You're like curling to a fish. <laughs> no, it was pretty good, that. Yeah, like I said, nothing like spectacular, nothing we haven't seen before. We did one at Primeval a few years ago and you walk in a room and these guys haven't done it but they actually had a spinning room which was really cool so uh, yeah good start of the night two really good mazes so far looking forward to the rest of it Right, so I mentioned about this street that's like unfinished. They do have a sweet tooth and pour room at the end here. And yeah, they're supposed to be, well it says here, skin deep tattooist. So we're supposed to be an actual tattooist in here. And a tarot card reader over there as well. But yeah, it's a shame that they haven't managed to finish it. There's actually nothing behind. You can just sort of see there's like catering unit or something in there. Yeah, a bit of a shame really, but yeah. I would have got a tattoo tonight if it was open. But yeah, really, really good event, really strong. Yeah, again, I keep slipping in the mud. <laughs> Maybe you should wear boots or something. So a girl I've noticed before had um, mud all up her back, so she must have fallen over. But yeah, the queue for that clown maze is massive. Yeah, you are alright? You're on the telly now. Run into you everywhere. Yeah, you do. Yeah. You okay? Yeah, not bad. We're off to go and do some more scare mazes. Yeah, which ones have you done so? Um, 
the one over there, I can't remember the name of it already, in the House of Clowns. Yeah, I mean, we've done the core and also the um, the other one, and they're both brilliant, etc. Really? Absolutely super. Yeah, my first time here. But yeah, yeah good my second. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, good to see you, lads. Yeah, good to see you. Yeah, again. fans of the channel. If you do see me, come and say hello. But yeah, I did show you, well, sort of showed you, with Haley, sort of showed you. There's so much stuff in here. Like drinks tokens, we got a cup as well, a, a cup token, ride tokens, food vouchers. This place is amazing. That waltzer looks rapid as well. Yeah, this is like where all the extreme mazes are in here. Good, isn't it? You got a fire and laser show and music yeah. show as well in there. Awesome. Look at it in here. This is awesome. And then you got Axe throwing over there. Yeah, got this laser show on now. People are getting beaten up on the stage or something, Marcus was telling me. Wow, look at the lasers and the smokes. Hey up. That's good. <laughs> Have, you Have I just missed it? Yeah. Oh. It's on, hold on. Excuse me. It's on here at 20 past. 20 past? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, cool. It's really good. Yeah, laser show. Missed it. Right, here we go. Vita Nova. I've heard about this one. You're going to be in for a treat. Yeah, apparently you get separated. So just, just me and Chris doing this one because nah. Haley's not a fan. <laughs> Right, so you just come out of the world famous Vita Nova. Said it right that time. Yeah, that was uh, that was quite intense. It was like you do get split up at the beginning, so you get put in a dark room. I thought I was going into the for a toilet at one point, but it wasn't. You go get split up, you get into a room, and then you go out backwards. So it's not something I've sort of experienced before other than at Thorpe Park. But yeah, there's a lot of strobe lighting in there, a lot of mirrors in there. There's a really good smoke room in there where you can't really see a lot. And then there's a section where you get thrown through a tunnel. There's actually three of them on my hands and knees. And I don't like hands and knees sort of bits because I'm 45 and my knees are not great. That's How not are what you? He said. What? <laughs> no, he said, I, really, I really like that. I really do like that, mate. It's, it's pretty. You're in the sh you're in, in the shade. You're in the shadow. In the there, dark, you're there you're in the dark now. Um, I, I, I love that place. It's mad, isn't it? It is very, very intense. If you don't like being split up, it's not. For well, you. it wasn't the splitting all that's bothered me. It's the crawling on the hands and knees bit. And apparently, we've got. I can see it over there. There's one where you have to wear waders and go through water. So that's not that bad. I'm not really looking forward to that one either. Ah, uh, you'll be fine. But no, it's been a. Um, been a really good night so far that maze is quite intense again it's a shame that we can't film inside because uh, well you want to know what anyway to be honest a lot of strobe lights mirrors smoke lots of dark lots of darkness as well I hate yeah there was yeah i couldn't see a thing from, no. uh, yeah i think one of the guys from your experience guy was touching me up at one point <laughs> and i, you, I wish. yeah <laughs> and then i turned around and touched mark yates he's like oh my god who's that said it was me so but yeah we've just come out of like a uh, back of a trailer right is it a trailer yeah it's a trailer there's a load of trailers together really intense but uh, yeah it was awesome was that there's another bar over here as well I think we've got two more mazes in this area to do and uh, yeah we'll get on some rides right so I said earlier about where you're walking and watch where you're walking because you might stand on a boulder and twist your ankle look at the size of this bloody thing it's like a meteorite on the ground so uh, yeah <laughs> Maybe they could do with clearing some of those big rocks up before people come in here because it's it's not great. What are you doing over here? Oh, um, I'm I'm filming. What's this? Uh, not very... showing this outside the Republic of England, are you? No, no. Promise. No. Yes, yes. Now, what have you been up to? What's your business here in the Republic of England? Uh, um, uh, 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 traveling, yes. visiting. Yeah. You haven't seen any suspicious activity, have you? Uh, other than yourself. 
Interesting. <laughs> yes. I'm not sure if we can trust you. Are you oh. with these two? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm with my friends. Yeah, yeah. They, oh, they, interesting. Yeah. Interesting choice of friends. Oh, you could trust me. I'm very trustworthy. Yes, are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Show me your wrist. You haven't got a rebel mark, have no. you? Other side. No, no. That's a palm, palm. Very interesting mark on your... Oh, God. Oh, yeah, yeah. Pl just... Plenty of marks on there. Yeah. Well, uh, if you see anything suspicious, let me know. I will okay? do. I'll come and find you. Right. Yes, thank and you. If you see any rebels, report them to me directly. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay. Understood. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Yes, yes. Okay. And smile as well, yeah. On your way. Oh. <laughs> Run away! <laughs> so, yeah, as I was rudely interrupted, yeah, watch out for boulders, because there's lots of them. And open fires as well. But, yeah, look at it round here. It's absolutely rammed. This is actually the queue for this one here, the core. Right, so the next maze is X4, and uh, yeah, it is absolutely rammed here. Like all the pathways are just full of people queuing up to go into the mazes. It's that busy in here, and then obviously you got a bit of a cattle pen over there as well. People queuing up, but yeah, literally everyone that's in this area are queuing up for the two. Well, in fact, the three mazes that are in here. So they maybe could do in the future opening it up a bit more. There's my new mate. <laughs> Good though, isn't it? How, what, how did you find the last one? It was all right. Maybe last year was a bit more intense, maybe a few more actors in places. But I really enjoy it. Being split up just brings that a little bit better intensity. And you're all right with crawling on your hands and knees? <laughs> and a minute, yeah. we have about five more years, I might be different. But... Well, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll be wading through water in a minute. Ah, it's easy. Yeah. Maybe you could be on your knees. X4 coming up next. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Used to being on your knees? At work, yes. <laughs> what? You're a postman. Why would you be on your knees? When I fall over. Ah, right, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 we're falling over. <laughs> right, we've just come out of X4. X4. And I've just said the same thing on their, their vlog. That was terrible, was that? You get given a glow stick, so you can't see nothing in there whatsoever. Uh, there's like a fake lift at the beginning, which was okay. That was, that was clever, but yeah, maybe a bit boisterous. It was there. very banging. If you've been to the Howl and done the the two uh, uh, lifts there that move a little bit, this thing would give you a bloody bad back. Uh, it literally was slamming on the floor, but you come out in a different room, which was very clever. And then, like I said, it's like a bit of a conga line, and you're getting a, a glow stick, but you can't see nothing in there. To a point where we both said the same thing when we come out. We ended up going in the uh, the rat runs. Yeah, we so did. we all we, we both did the same thing, and uh, we ended up going the wrong way. And there was <laughs> too much smoke in there. Really you could see weird. nothing. Don't listen to them. Oh, Where? yeah. You could see nothing yeah, at all. Listen to us. But... Yeah, listen to us. Um, it's yeah, not yeah. The, not the best maze ever. I don't think I've ever done. There is steaming in there, but you can't oh. see it. Yes, I think there's slightly little improvement. Get rid of the smoke. Maybe try and make it a bit blacker. Or just put more lights in there. Maybe a little bit more light. Like the glow sticks do kind of work, but, but no, without I, the smoke. No, I, I could see nothing. Without the smoke. Yeah, I, I ended up turning left at one point, kicking. I ended up kicking the theming on the floor, and then a guy behind me is like, oh, "You're going the wrong way." I'm like, "Yeah, and, <laughs> yeah." I've just kicked the theming on the floor, so uh, yeah, not not a great maze, unfortunately. I've done a lot better than that. I think it would have been fine had there not been so much smoke. It just it needs to have lighting in there, or some better than a little, t literally tiny little glow stick. That was it, really. But everything else has been pretty, uh, pretty good tonight. But we've got one more today, one more today, and it's the one where you wear waders and go through water. So, uh, oh yes, yeah. And then <laughs> any run throughs if we want to do any. Runs. Yeah, we've got unlimited fast passes. We've got a couple of rides to go on Walter. Maybe get some more food. I don't really know. Get another drink for sure. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we'll do the last maze, which is just next door, called the Core. Right, last maze of the night is the core. So, um, yeah, I don't know what I feel about this one. I mean, I'm not scared of water as such, but I don't really, I've never worn waders in my life. And you swim? Yeah, I could swim. Oh, and I've, right, I've, I've done how long, like- How long can you hold your breath for? Uh, about 30 seconds. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. really? Oh. You go underwater? Yeah. Oh, you better not. Yeah. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not doing it then. <laughs> but no, I have done like 
water sports before I used to have a kayak and my dad used to do windsurfing that sort of stuff so but yeah I've never actually worn waders before never done fishing well I have done fishing but not the fact that I've had to get in the water so um, yeah I mean I've heard a lot about it can you even see me sort of <laughs> anyway I'll give you a review when we come off this one um, but yeah it's been a really good night tonight and I do recommend coming it's just I'd probably do the one we'd let X for I'd probably do that one last maybe it's not the or even first because yeah do it first because obviously all the other ones are better than that one so we, we would improve your night it's been a really good night so far well, I don't even know what time it is to be honest oh it's only half eight we've got the laser show to see as well because we keep missing that and then the funfair rides but yeah it is very dark in places I mean this whole entire area has just got this red light well you, you can see it so it doesn't really um, sort of like separate the actual mazes because there's feet and over over there this is the exit of the one we've just done and then you've got the other one just here so um, yeah it would have been better if they were like slightly separated or spaced out a bit more because it's very very crammed around here you can just see all the people so yeah we're still waiting for this maze here behind us and the the laser show just started again so we're, we might miss some of this right so we've been given some waders he said uh, what size are you i said uh, 2xl and Haley's like no your shoes i'm like we well, didn't ask that he just said what size are you i don't know big <laughs> uh, and, then, and you've got a drawstring bag as well to put all your, your shoes and anything into it i mean this is just such a faff the amount of people queuing up for this and everyone's in here now trying to put waders on like Surely they could come up with a better idea than doing this. Because to me, this is just such a faff. And um, yeah, it's not a great night out if you're uh, taking your shoes off and putting waders on to go through water. Never mind, I hope the maze is really good and I'll tell you what it's like when we come out. Right, so I've just experienced the core for the first time. Yeah, really great concept though, actually, walking through the water. Again, I wish I could have filmed it because it actually inside the maze, the theming was brilliant. Like, obviously, you were like in a sewer that had, well, sewers have water in it. You had sirens with like makeup. There was an animatronic that kept popping up through a green laser. However, the waders, Haley. Not, not great, are they? No, for us chunky people, yeah. it's like you literally have to stuff yourself we're, in. We're, like you're stuffing a turkey at Christmas. Oh, thank, yeah. <laughs> but, but no, it really did. You then can't, like, you haven't got very much movement, and when you're going up and down the stairs, it's not then, it's not great. That being said, I did say this last year in our review, and it's the same again. If you're going to do waders, they need to be, maybe get some that have, like, an ex extended belt, or have, like, an extended belt for. Like a set of size <laughs> I yeah. want to do that one. It, it's um no, it's like when he said to me, "What your size?" and I said two XL, and you <laughs> and you're like, "No, your shoe size." Well, the shoe size of the boots are obviously fine, but I couldn't get my bloody thing on at all. I mean, it was actually broken. So, but you're only walking through what a, a, a two foot of water. It's yeah. not very deep. It literally, it's below. Well, I don't know. To be fair, it's I think below the knees. I think as long as you can get it to your hips, yeah, you'll be fine. Um, yeah. just kind of pull it up to your hips and then, yeah. I had a coat on as well. So yeah, well, I put, I, yeah, yeah, I had to put my coat on over. Uh, all your valuables have to go into a bag. Uh, but I mean, yeah, great concept. The maze was okay. The idea of it with the waders, not for me. So I've done a few mazes tonight, especially those three over there. Just yeah, not 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 keen on them. One one where you're crawling on your hands and knees, not keen on that. One where it's pitch black, can't see anything, walking into things, not keen on that. And then walking through water with skin tight waders on, not great. I think the two first ones we did first were the best yeah, ones we've done tonight. Ones, Definitely, uh, House of Clowns and Mel Mel Malefica. Mal Malefica. But anyway, we've had a good night. VIP We're going bar? to get a yeah, VIP bar. What did you think of the core? 
It was unique, he was missing his ending this year. He had oh. last year, it had some guy at the end that would literally splash him. He actually came out quite wet, but yeah, I don't know whether or not there wasn't an actor there. We missed it because of the batching. I don't know. But... They might have got rid of it, people complaining. Because the point of wearing the waders is so you don't get wet. But there if wasn't any... There wasn't anywhere that you were gonna get Not wet. Not really, no. But then, it, like you're saying, a guy at the end that splashes you. Yeah. Not a great idea. There was only a little splash. It was just but the theming's different. great in it. The concept we'd said is brilliant. It's different. But it just didn't work well with the uh, with with the larger people, should we say? <laughs> I think batching as well. Being at the back of the queue didn't help. Yeah. I mean, I think I think Haley got in her way. It's better than I got into mine because I had to get Chris to sort of pull me up. Oh. Oh, yeah, <laughs> me as well. Right, anyway, the whole event itself is brilliant. It's so busy though, it's absolutely rammed. That whole section where we've just been where the three mazes are, it is rammed round there. So you can't see where the mazes are, the entrances, the exits, the queue lines, or anything like that. Overall, really good night. We'll get a drink, we'll go on some food. We've got a few rides now. This is cool. So yeah, we've used our golden ticket for the spirit part. <laughs> what is it? What is this? Oh. You okay, sir? Yes, yes. Where have you been? Um, looking for the bar. Looking for the bar. Well, yeah. I guess you found it, but I wouldn't say it's safe in here. Oh, is it not? It's a darkness. Yeah. And it doesn't feel right. Oh, oh. I go. A girl died in the other room. Oh, really? I performed an exorcism. Oh, oh or at least you? I tried to. Sister Amelia's faith. My partner, who I brought in there to help me. She doubted in her faith, and I guess that reflected onto mine. Oh, so, so, so where do we get drinks from then? Are you sure that's what you want right now? Yes, yes. To forget. Well, I'm, I am extremely parched. Maybe. Well, you should look inside yourself. Oh. Instead of outside circumstances. Oh. Yeah. Oh, there is, there, oh, there is actually a bar in here. Hello. Hello. Um, she can't. She can't. Father Thomas saved, saved her. Father Thomas was supposed to save her. Yeah, this uh, this bar's pretty cool actually. So yeah, you've got to pay for your own drinks. I got another Red Bull, but it's totally themed and immersive in here. Father Thomas said that. Apologies. I must get Amelia back to the Sister of Mercy Church at once. Amelia, stand up. I suggest you leave this place oh, as soon as you can. He is still here. You are not I am, safe. I haven't finished my drink yet. Come on. Run away. Yeah, so there's actually um, a show next door called The Exorcism. But it's sold out, so we can't even see that. And what did you say about it? It's, um, the best way to describe it is... It's kind of like a theatrical experience. So other than, it's not like a, a scare maze as such. You don't walk a linear route or go in different ways. You kind of all sit in a circle and uh, a story unfolds in front of you. It's really cool, like yeah. so many special effects. The acting is top notch, just sort of the best acting on, on the whole part. So, yeah, oh, cool. Really yeah, a bit gutted we missed that, to be honest. But uh, never mind, so we'll have this drink, go on a, well, I'll say a couple of rides. I'm not doing the Miami. We'll do the Waltz and then we'll do the first maze that we did Again, because, yeah, whatever it's called. <laughs> the one that I can't pronounce because it was awesome. I'll tell you what, some of the mazes might have not been to our sort of taste and liking tonight, but that is one of the best theme bars I think I've ever been in. That was brilliant, that. I love the audio in there, the lighting. Um, it was like a VIP bar, but we didn't really know anything about it because you've got to go through the exorcism which we can't do we told you it's an upcharge and it's fully booked up so yeah a vip bar was really good but we had to pay for our own drinks and it was four pound fifty for a red bull 
Uh, it doesn't matter. I mean, we did get a token for a free drink earlier anyway, so... But I tell you what, it's cold tonight. Well, I think we've got to go over and do the waltzer now. And then maybe the... Uh, Malefica again. The the first maze we did, we'll make that the last maze of the night. A re and re go through there because it was brilliant. But no, I've had a really good night tonight. Something completely different. It's just a couple of things that obviously they need to tweak and change. And uh, we've been told that the X4, the one that was pitch black that we told you about, apparently they've only that's a new thing that they've done to it. So it's full of theming, but we couldn't see any of it because it's pitch black. Here we are, Marcus. <laughs> We're going to be on the telly again. Right, next up is the wall. So yeah, this thing looks amazing. I've got no light on me at all. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I get copyright now, but this looks amazing. Fair trade wall. So it looks absolutely stunning. Right, time to send it on the waltz. Good job there's no uh, copyright music on at the minute. Well, that was maybe why you turn it off. No, it's a radio station. Woo! Fast already, we're not even getting spun yet. Yeah, love a fair trade waltz. This one's absolutely stunning. Oh, yeah, I get it now, yeah. It's the music they're playing all over. They're five star. And that's one of the fastest waltzes I think I've ever been on. How was that, Ailey? I really enjoyed that. Yeah. But when you said, oh, I'm the waltzer king, and then I come <laughs> up and go, should we do it again? You go, no. Well, I don't think that, I don't think yeah. that stands. Uh, well, I think I could do it again, but yeah. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I really enjoyed that. It was well good, that, that was wasn't the best. it? Yeah, one of the fastest waltzes I think I've ever been on that. Super smooth, fair trade waltzer. Looks absolutely stunning on the camera as well. And I tell you what, isn't stunning. Um, Chris has just come up to us and said, we can't do the maze again because it closed at half 10. So that's it, end of the night, unfortunately. We have had a good night tonight. A big, huge thank you to Chris and Haley for inviting me down because they had a spare ticket. Um, we've had a really good night. Yeah, Thanks. some of the mazes have been a bit weird. The first one we did was amazing. To be fair, I think whenever you go to a scare park, there's always going to be some that maybe don't yeah. get up to the standards, and yeah. that's fine. There's something for everybody. Yeah, definitely. It's a really good event. It's been rammed tonight. People we spoke to have said it's one of the busiest they've ever seen it. 
I think it's great. The layout's great. There's a couple of little things that are not quite finished. Obviously, the boulders in the floor, so watch where you're walking. I'd suggest wearing boots or something. A couple of fun fair rides here, a couple of little shows that they do as well. The secret bar was really nice. We liked it in there. Your food looked amazing. I don't think I'll bother getting food now. It's a bit, a bit too late for me now. You can't be eating late at night and trying to lose weight at the same time. The waltzer was amazing, but yeah, we've, we've had a good night. Again, super. thank you for these guys for inviting me down. Thank you for Avon as well for inviting us. Oh, well, yeah, well, yeah, thanks for Avon for yeah, inviting yeah. us. But uh, yeah, don't forget to uh, follow these guys, um, Adventure Times UK, the link for their, it'll be, down, it'll be down there somewhere or in the description box below. Um, but anyway, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell for next time we'll upload another video. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.